What's up guys? Uh, my name is Hirsch and I'm going to be reviewing my classmates uh, portfolio website. His name is Ricky and uh, yeah, so let's just dive straight into it. Um, I think <laughs> for starters, I think he had uh, probably one of my favorite um, one of my favorite portfolio sites. There were a few things that needed to be touched, but like they were like really small things and I feel like his aesthetic and his um, the work that he has to show on his site is really nice. Um, I'm a big fan of how it's all one page. It's not like a bunch of clicking, uh, where's this, where's that. Um, uh, what else? I also like, I like how um, he has all of his work in one big section. Uh, to be honest, I would probably, if I were him, because he has a lot of content. So if I were him, I would probably section off some of that work just because when I was looking at it, the, looking at it, it was just kind of like not overwhelming, but it was just a lot. Like it was kind of like a endless sea of content just scrolling through it. But it was really nice content, and it showcased pretty much all of his skills, which I was a huge fan of. Um, yeah, other, I would just if I were him, I would think about. Uh, organizing all of my work just because he has so much of it which is a great thing um, uh, at, on the menu page he kind of had he had this aesthetic where it was uh, his background was moving and I didn't I liked it I didn't think it was anything wrong with that but maybe possibly if he's gonna use that I think uh, he should maybe find one that moves a little less just because of course okay like i liked it but you know everybody isn't gonna like it and it may be kind of hard for people to read the words that were on the home screen um i know his words were white with the black background but the aesthetic was white uh gray and red they were like moving lines it was really cool but some people may have trouble reading that and Although I wasn't one of those people, you never know. There's a lot of people would be coming to his website. Um, what else? Oh, the words on his, on his um, the words on the main menu. They, there were two boxes. On the main menu, that were holding the aesthetic, I guess, kind of keeping it under control, if you will, and at the end of his sentence on one of his uh on i guess his like introduction sentence on his paragraph or i mean on his website <laughs> uh a few of the words kind of went off into the other box so maybe i would just kind of like center or not center line but left align some of the or the sentence rather um also i feel like he should probably think about um changing the hierarchy on his main menu uh there's nothing wrong with it but just like shortening the name so maybe possibly just having the hierarchy be his brand name the introduction sentence and then boom straight to his work because it was all awesome and the website was pretty cool like i said i like how i didn't have to scroll through or i mean not scroll through but i like how i didn't have to click through everything trying to find stuff Everything was just on one page. Um, that was really convenient. I'm sure other people would like that as well. And yeah, other than all of that, I think uh, Ricky had a great website and I'm looking forward to see what else he can do next. Kind of curious. <laughs> all right, guys, have a great night.